everybody, it's Stranger Gamer back and I got another opening video. Dinosaur King, of course. Because this nice little box showed up this morning. All ready for me to open. Ooh, what's it gonna be? It's like opening a Christmas present. Let's find out. It's gonna be sad if I accidentally cut the cards for this. So yeah, just bought a couple of things off Joe's. Nothing too special. But I did buy a um, one of them refill packs for Japanese fifth edition, which is in here. Ooh. Actually, I'll put it on camera so you don't have to see my dirty desk. Oh, and that's the camera. There it is. Okay, this is the refill. And as you can see, there's a card this in there. And these are, this is from another lot I purchased, so I didn't get much. It's going to be a quick video. I'll oh, just adjust the camera a bit. Okay. Uh, we'll go through the refill last. So this is the lot I purchased quite a while ago. And it's got a butt ton of golds. It's like a gold brush. Gold brush. Let me get in there. I mean, I pretty much know what's in, in here, so nothing's going to take me by surprise. Uh, and then I got this small little lock. Uh, it's got a silver fragment X in it. But we'll open the good stuff last. Because I've never opened a refill pack before, so I don't know what to expect. But I'll go into more of that later. If I can ever get in here. Okay, oh, oh, they're nice and sleeved. That's quite nice. I need some <laughs> sleeves. Okay, so there's Sophagonax, Carnotaurus, uh, Parasaurolophus, Degasaurus, Ceratosaurus, Staracosaurus, and... North America egg card and Edmontonia. It's nothing special, but it was going cheap, so I picked it up. And I do actually need this car now. So I decided to pick it up. Now this one has a lot of golds. So this one's going to be pretty good. And most of these golds will probably go on eBay because I have most of them already, but some will be keeping. So, get ready to be blown away. One T-Rex, two T-Rex, three, four, five, and six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, ten Rexes. Just, that's just standard or I'm like a T-Rex hoarder, yeah? <laughs> okay, is this 2004? 2005. But it's still very nice and it's in very good condition. Um, I'll probably keep one of these T Rexes. I think I keep the firework foil one because I don't have one. But most, pretty much all of them will be sold. I'll maybe keep one or two of spares. Okay, Paras are all of us now. One, two, three, four Paras. Go with the other one I got in the other lot. Cychania's turn. One, two, three, four, five. Two and five, two and five, two and five. Two. Oh, yeah. If you're wondering why I'm checking the date on these first editions, it's because there was a pre-release set of the of this set. And they have 2004 on the back and they're extremely rare. So that's why I'm checking, but it's usually easy to tell. Just focusing on that. Pretty good look, actually. More Cychanias. Okay, now for the, my favourite bit. Megaraptor, 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 Megaraptor. Three misprints are there. There's three misprints. Probably keep all of them. Because <laughs> I'm a Megaraptor hoarder. 
Staracosaurus, I think there's three of these. So this should just be three. Oh, oh, there's the, pretty much the best card of the set, the Deinonychus. And now I know people are thinking, oh, how many of those have you got? Probably got like ten. No, just one, just the one. But it's a spear since I already have one. This card I'm actually keeping is a Spinosaurus, which is very nice. It's the winter one. And that's it for the golds. Some people are like, what do you mean that's it? That's loads. And yeah, it's awesome. Okay, it's Pachyrhinosaurus. This one I'm going to be keeping. Another Pachyrhinosaurus. A Margosaurus. A few of those. Carcharodontosaurus. Nice to have another one of these. This Carcharodontosaurus I will be keeping. A couple of Eutoraptors. Fourth edition, which I'll be keep. Well, I'll keep one of them. Stegosaurus. Opirhinus. A Fire Egg. And then we've got some super moves. I think that's Earthquake. I think that's Earthquake. Cyclone, a few of those, Volcano Burst, a couple of those. Funny enough, I actually got an English one of this. I got it yesterday. Um, Nature's Blessing, Electric Charge, and another Electric Charge. So, yeah, that's the good stuff. Well, the refill might be good, but it depends what's in it. So, yeah, just quickly, uh, uh, yeah. Managed to get some English cards yesterday, Volcano Burst, Spike Arrows. There's mostly, well, but not all my English cards left on top of my Japanese cards. Now for the exciting bit. Ooh, what's it gonna be? Um, based on what I've heard from other people, apparently a gold is, from the older sets, is one in 800, and there's 200 cards per refill, so I have a one in four chance, but I know that there is a hidden card in this set, which is a Fukui Saurus. So I'm assuming it, it might be easier to get a gold. So I'm hoping, can we get a gold? If there's any gold I would want, it's probably a T-Rex or Carnotaurus. I mean, Spinosaurus I already have, and Parrot I already have, but I could do with another one, to be honest. To go in my main folder. Anyway, let's get this open. I hope that, yeah, it's sealed. Ooh, what's it gonna be? Actually, I wonder if I can tell. I don't think I can tell. Ooh. I don't think I got gold. Hang on. Ooh, actually, yeah, I think I got a gold. Yeah, you can just see the compatibility chart. Look. Let's just, let's just open it. But I don't think I got a gold. Which I'm very sad. So yeah, it's a third, fifth, fifth edition poster for the Japanese. Which is basically the English third edition, which I have an English version of this poster. But it's quite nice to have a new one. I don't think I have a gold. Oh, I don't even think I got a silver. Wow, this, this refill is going to be trash. <laughs> that actually, this might actually be a fail. This might actually be like the worst refill pack ever. <laughs> I'm so hyped for this and then I'm going to be like so disappointed. Oh, come on, what a refill. It's like, ah, oh, no, it's not good. But as I said, it's... As I said, I think golds are like 1 in 800 in older sets, so... But I'm not sure if, it's for the, 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 if that's the case for this one because... This one has a hidden card, which is Fukui Saurus, which I mentioned earlier. But most of these cards, they help me complete the common set, so that's convenient. Uh, okay, I'll be with me a minute. Gotta find a way to open these. Don't want to be, don't want to, don't want to look a spoiler, so. Right, in view, okay. We'll put the foils to a side, I think that's quick strike. I'll go through the cons pretty quick. Thank you. Hello. Primal Fury, Sukumimus. 
Divos, Dr. Hammer, Seto Zero Ooh, there's a Froyon. Of course, I've already got it. Electric Charge. Ooh, I think I see something. Oh, I've already got this Utoraptor. It's nice, though. It is nice. Oh, it's so ungrateful. No, no, no ungrateful. It is nice. It is a nice pick. So I'm hoping to get like something like that with a Cyclone. Acro. Oh, a Shant. <laughs> Gigging on a sword. Can we get a gold? Oh, there's a Shockwave card. Oh, oh, we got the, well, we got the hidden card of the set. Which is quite nice. It's Fukui Saurus. That's the hidden card, which means we're probably not going to get a gold. Because I get this instead, which I already have, like, five of them. <laughs> oh, Baryonyx. That's quite nice. Yeah, I think this is going to be a fail. But that's it. If we can get a gold, it'll be, it would have been worth it. But it doesn't look likely at the minute. But no, we got to have faith. Wait, what? Okay, now I'm confused. Oh, there's a Cockeridonosaurus. It's quite nice. Okay, now I'm confused. I thought Fukui Source was the hidden card of this set, and I thought only hidden cards come 1 in 800. So, I'm really confused. I'll have to ask on Discord later. Ooh, that's nice. Got a few super moves. Oh yeah, fun fact, I think this one's actually a misprint. It's light recovery, but the, you know, the compatibility chart on the bottom is wrong. It's quite nice. Come on, give me a gold. Oh, another shant. Like, the reason why I don't like buying refill packs is because you get so many commons and such. But since I'm trying to complete this set, it's not a bad trade-off. And especially if I get a gold, but it doesn't look like I'm going to get a gold. But nope, we're going to have faith. Gonna have few... And there it is. A T-Rex. No, I'll take that. That's that's worth it. That is worth it for it's, for the T-Rex. Probably would have liked the Carnotaurus, to be honest. But no, I'll take it. I will 100% take that. That's made this refill worth it. Oh, yeah. Okay, can we, can we defy logic and get another gold? I don't think we will, though, but still. We'll have to see. So yeah, this is oh the Torphosaurus. Oh, don't think we've got one then yet. I think that's all the another Fukuisaurus. Man, I wish they were golds instead. <laughs> oh, a Shant. Ooh, a Pachyrhinosaurus. Ooh, getting a few followers. Mole attack. Oh, another Fukuisaurus. Baryonyx. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get another gold. But that's it. I'll take a T-Rex. I'll gladly take that T-Rex. I made this reef all worth it. And another Fukuisaurus. And we end with Inosaurus. So overall, pretty happy. So let's look at the ratios. So we got one gold. I mean, it could mean that is every 200 is a gold, which is not bad ratios. And I got the T-Rex. It's actually nice to have one of the this t version of the T-Rex in mint condition, since my English one is not in good condition. And five Fukui Saurus cards, which I really wasn't expecting. Because you know, I thought the Fukui Source would be the hidden card, the hidden card of the sets, and it only comes one in eight hundred. But I guess I was wrong. So bronzes, we got two Torvos, two sh free shants, and two batteries. And silver wise, I didn't get many silvers, which I'm really surprised at. Pachyrhinosaurus, Cacodontosaurus. You didn't get a Stegosaurus. So I really wanted the Stegosaurus. 
quite disappointed at that, to be honest. But, you know, the T-Rex made this lot worth it. And a few super moves as well. Um, a few were needed, a few probably offload. And then, yeah, so uh, overall I'd say I'm pretty content with that, to be honest. I'm happy. I've pretty much completed the common set now. Maybe may have enough cards to like sell a common set of fifth editions, but I'm quite happy with that. You know, the T Rex makes it worth it. Dun. But uh, one thing I surprised about didn't get many silver, so I thought I'd get more silvers than that. But it looks like you get I don't know if this is the exact ratio, but you can use this as a ratio if you want to buy this refill. So I'd say one gold, three silvers, seven bronzes, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, four, fifteen super moves, and for some reason, five Fukui sources. Wonderful. And that's going to wrap up this video. So if you enjoyed this video, if you enjoyed me, if you join me doing um, opening refills, I might might do more of it. I might do more refills. I quite quite enjoyed that. But as I said, there'll probably have to be a refill that I actually want. So I won't, won't do Japanese first edition, for example, since I have a complete set. So I'd say based on the card list, I'd say, well, I, I got them two already. So Carnotaurus is the only one I really need now. And the Stegosaurus, I need that one. Don't have that one. But other than that, I'd probably say I have a near complete set, which is awesome. So if, if you like the video, leave a like in the comment in 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 the dis leave a like under the video. Hit that like button. Hit it hard. And this is Stranger Gamer signing off.